Hi everybody. So today we're looking at Acts chapter 13, verse 13 to 25. And this is where Paul has now moved to Pisidian Antioch. So this is in Turkey, if you're interested. And he's gone to a synagogue and he's been asked by the leaders there to talk to the people. And straight away, no mercy, and he stood up and launched into this sermon. And he's, he wants to primarily do this. He wants to talk about Jesus. He wants to talk to them about how Jesus will forgive their sins. But he doesn't just launch straight into that. So first up, he goes through their history that they will know really well. So these are Jewish people and maybe people that maybe weren't born Jewish, but they're following that way of life and they're going to the synagogue. And so they'll already know all this, but he talks to them about their history. So walking through the wilderness, about the prophets, the judges, about King David, King Saul. And then he talks about Jesus and he's doing this because he wants to fit Jesus into their story and making it clear that Jesus wasn't an afterthought, that God always had Jesus as part of their plan. He was always going to be there. And I think the challenge for us is firstly, taking any opportunity that we can to talk to people about Jesus. If anything comes up, being brave like Paul. Just think how different things would have been if Paul had been asked to speak to the people and actually he'd gone, oh, I've not prepared anything or, oh, actually I was just gonna sit quietly in the back for this one. It's Think how differently things would be. You know, a bit of a spoiler alert for the rest of the chapter, but actually, as a result of this, Paul's invited to come and talk to the people again, and people asked him questions and followed him afterwards. So it's a challenge for us to be brave like Paul, and also just think about who we're talking to. What is their existing knowledge? What is their existing beliefs? Being respectful of that, not just coming out and saying, no, you're wrong, but thinking about what they already know, and thinking how Jesus can fit in with that. All right, have a great day.